below. It is spooky season officially. Um, I just took pictures of my full outfit look. Um, so look forward to seeing that on Instagram. I don't know when this video will come out. Excuse you, wind. I know I said it's spooky season, but chill out. Um, it's time to have fun in quarantine. So I am a self-proclaimed uh, dessert connoisseur. I um, am a, I'm proudly addicted to sugar, and um, so I decided that I was going to give my opinions on Halloween candy. I should preface this by saying that I am not that big of a candy person. I like baked goods and like ice cream, like full desserts, more than I like candy. So like my real niche is like pie and cake and brownies and cookies. Mm. That's where my real niche is, but like I feel qualified to give my opinions on these candies as well. So let's get started. Um, okay, so apparently America's favorite candy, according to usatoday.com, not sponsored. Um, so the first one is Reese's Peanut Butter Cups. I don't know if I said this before, but I also don't like chocolate by itself. I, I think chocolate is too bitter for me. I don't think it's creamy enough. I don't think it's sweet enough. Um, I don't know, like the types of sweet that I prefer isn't really chocolatey things. I like vanilla, I like cinnamon, I love cinnamon, really good. Um, so I'm not a super big chocolatey person, but like chocolate in desserts can be good, like chocolate cake, some brownies really do hit, um, but chocolate by itself, like, unless it's like white chocolate, like, not for me. Um, I like peanut butter. But I only really like peanut butter in a PB&J or with bananas. I am not someone that likes chocolate and peanut butter. Um, like not even chocolate and peanut butter flavored things. I especially don't like peanut butter based desserts at all. Like I hate anything that's a dessert with like a nut. Um, so definitely do not like Reese's Peanut Butter Cups. Um, they're okay, like, if I had to eat them, or if I was, like, craving sugar so bad and that was the only option, I would eat it. Um, I have eaten them before, and, you know, I would eat it and, like, not spit it out, but, like, if I had the option to give it away or trade it for something else, I would do that first. Snickers. I... I do not recall what Snickers taste like. Um, I know I probably have tasted it, but I remember not what, what's in a Snickers? Hold on. Maybe I'm not qualified to do this video. I don't even know what it tastes. Oh no. <laughs> I just saw the picture of it. Okay. A Snickers is nougat topped with caramel and peanuts surrounded by milk chocolate. Yeah, no, not for me. That is a candy bar that I would spit out if I ate it um, because of the nuts. Like I am not about peanuts. That is something that I like. If someone paid me to eat it, I would eat it. But like if I'm not being paid to eat it, I would definitely spit it out. I don't think I would willingly consume it. Um, why are all like the top ones are like chocolate like the candy that I like is more fruity based. M&M's. You know what? I'm going to lump M&M's and Hershey bars together because my opinions on them are very similar. Uh, it's just chocolate. One is, I guess, like m easier to eat. But um, again, it's okay. I would, you know, I would eat 
both of those things if someone paid me. Sometimes on the rare occasion in which I want chocolate, um, I can eat like a Hershey's Kiss and be like, yeah, that was good. Um, or like a M&M and be like, yeah, I, my chocolate has been satisfied. Um, I like the outside of M&M though, like before you get to the chocolate part, the coating, the candy coating, that's pretty good. And when I was young, I used to suck on them until I got to the chocolate part and then spit the chocolate part out. <laughs> Next one, candy corn. I have not eaten candy corn in years. Sorry, I bumped the camera. I don't know why I haven't eaten, well, I do know why I haven't eaten candy corn in years because I'm not like openly seeking candy. Like I'm not gonna spend money on candy like for myself, but um, I remember liking candy corn when I ate it. I, when I was a youngin'. So I like it. I assume that I still like it. Haven't had it in years though. Don't even remember what, it, I know it was sweet, but like I don't think it has like a flavor. Like I think the flavor is just sweet. <laughs> like it's not like vanilla or cinnamon or fruity or chocolate based. It's just sweet. Oh, okay. So the next one I actually like is Skittles. Skittles are, they're pretty good. Um, I would totally eat Skittles. Um, if I'm going to like a movie theater and I want to like snack on a candy, I get I get Skittles. Um, but like I like the original. I don't like sour Skittles that much. Like they I eat, but like, eh, eh. I like like the regular Skittles or the tropical Skittles because those those hit. Um, you know, like they don't hit super. Like they don't hit different. You know what I mean? Like they don't hit super super hard, but like they hit like I'll happily eat it and be like oh yeah that was good um the next one a uh, starburst I love a good starburst um I would say starburst is one of my favorite candies um especially the strawberry one y'all know the pink one is the best um it's good I also just like the texture of starburst like it's they're chewy but not like chewy like gum yeah. Also, if you've ever had the Starburst gum, you know, it's nasty. Um, it tastes good for like 10 seconds and then you're like, <laughs> so would not recommend Starburst gum, but like regular Starburst. Pretty good. Um, Tootsie Pops. Okay. So. How many licks does it take to get to the Tootsie Roll of a Tootsie Pop? The world may never know. I like lollipops and Tootsie Rolls separately what I'm not down with is them together that is not the move um putting like a chocolate because Tootsie Rolls are like one of like the chocolate candies that I genuinely enjoy because it barely tastes like chocolate um but like putting a chocolatey thing like I'm also I am not one to like fruit and chocolate like together like no I learned that I'm not about that fruit should be separate from chocolate they should not be together so the fact that like you gon' like eat a lollipop that's like fruity base that's like orange flavor and then you gonna have a then you go chew on some chocolate flavor like, like no no also I never finish like I very rarely finish lollipops like to even get unless it's like those really small dum-dums you know what I'm talking about but like the big ones like halfway through I'm like you know what I'm done with this I don't even want to get to the middle um unless it's a blow pop because I actually like like the idea of having like bubble gum like a fruity based bubble gum in the middle like that was smart honestly whoever thought of that genius but the Tootsie Roll lolly like no so now we're gonna move on to Forbes.com to give my opinions on the 10 least popular like and most popular based on Forbes okay so the hated ones circuit peanuts what oh yeah um I had one of these things and if you don't know those are like like they're not like actual peanuts they're like okay imagine a packing peanut okay but instead it's like a weird mix between a marshmallow gummy and it is like a weird orangey beige color 
that's what we're talking about. I have not had one of those in years, bro. But that's because the last time I ate one, I was like, this is nasty. Don't remember the exact flavor, just remember it was nasty. So I uh, hate those. <laughs> also, hasn't I haven't seen one in years, because like, who the heck buys those? Like, like even if you're buying candy for Halloween, like for trick or treaters, like why would you buy like that? Like that's nasty. Do anyway. <laughs> candy. Oh, we already talked about candy corn. Wax Coke Coke bottles. Okay, I used to like these. Like I used to really really like these, and then one day I bought some because I was like, oh yeah, I really like these, and then I ate them and they were just nasty um so i guess my taste buds changed when i was like six i was like yo those go hard but now i'm like they really um don't go hard they go soft um neko wafer i don't even know i don't even know what that is so moving on peanut butter kisses Okay, I assume that that's just like Hershey Kisses, but like peanut butter. So no, um, not down. Um, Tootsie Roll, people hate Tootsie Rolls, really? I did not know that. I like Tootsie Rolls, but we already talked about that. Smarties, I like Smarties, they're pretty good. Um, when I was a youngin, uh, me and my friends used to crush them up and pretend that it was not candy um because we thought we were like edgy um but yeah i like smarties they're pretty good uh licorice i don't think i have ever had black licorice in my life but red licorice like twizzlers go hard i like i like twizzlers they're um they're good good and plenty First of all, who names a candy good and plenty? That doesn't make any sense. That sounds like the name, I don't even know. <laughs> but like, who names a candy? That... Like, who's like, oh, I wanna go to the car store and get some good and plenty. Like, what? Anyway, that sounds dumb. But, um, licorice and a hard candy. Uh, no, I've never had that. Um, Mary Jane's? Okay, are we talking about candy? Because it really does not sound like it. Um, peanut butter flavor, I'm out. No. I didn't even finish reading that description. Peanut, no. Um, let's move Twix. Yo, I remember the first time I had a Twix. I will never forget this. I was in the car with my mom. Me, my mom, and my brother just left church service, right? It was, um, because when I was a kid, fun fact about me, um, I used to live in Ohio and I moved across the country um, when I was like five. So I remember this so vividly. It was in Ohio. It was, it must have been near Halloween. It must have been because my church in Ohio, they did, they didn't call it Halloween, but like it was a Halloween party. Um, they called it the fall festival is Halloween anyway um because my mom was uh definitely afraid that me and my brother were gonna get like poisoned if we went trick-or-treating like in neighborhoods so we went trick-or-treating inside of the church um there was like different classrooms in the church and then you would trick-or-treat in the church um because my mom was like I don't want my children to die of Halloween candy um can you tell that my mom is like super like I don't want to say paranoid but like careful um anyway and I remember this so vividly I never had a Twix but um I got it and I was like oh my gosh this is like because my mom also never really bought me and my brother candy like if we got candy it's because like someone gave it to us so I never had a Twix and so I was really hoping that it was gonna be good you know what I mean so I opened it and I take a bite out of it and I remember being like and my dreams were crushed I thought it was going to be delicious. It was not. My life and everything I thought I knew about Twix was ruined. Um, <laughs> but besides that, I like the like marketing of Twix. Like I like the idea of like left Twix and right Twix. And I like those commercials where it would be like, 
we're completely different um, from each other. I, I like those commercials. I thought those were funny, but like, Twits taste terrible. So, Kit Kat. Okay, Kit the white chocolate Kit Kats, they hit. Um, last time I had one, I would never forget this. I was in the, I was like taking a break between taking um, the SAT test and the day before because that was a Friday. All of the teachers, like they knew like all like my whole grade was gonna take the SAT the next day um, on Saturday so they all gave us like little candies and the candy that I had was a white chocolate Kit Kat and they were like oh like this is just like a sugar pick-me-up for you know when you're on your break so I ate it and I was like wow this is good normal Kit Kats they I I used to like them but then nah. <laughs> um, nerds well um, although my favorite nerd is a person and uh, not a candy and so I can't eat him because that's illegal um but on the candy uh they're pretty good they I sometimes when I was a kid I would like you know tip, tilt the box back but then I've choked on nerds plenty of times um uh, so uh I, I I'm low-key afraid to eat nerds like straight out of the box I have to like put a little on my hand and then like eat it like a like I'm a goat <laughs> or something like <laughs> oh man, someone's gonna screenshot that. Um, <laughs> Butterfinger. Um, never had one. Ever since that Twix tobacco, I just, I just never trusted candy bars ever again. <laughs> Sour Patch Kids. Yo, Sour Patch Kids are really good. I like the, I like the Sour Sweet Gone motto but I also just think they taste good especially the lemon one I don't normally like lemon flavored things um but the lemon one tastes like lemonade it's really good um again I think Sour Patch Kids is like my third favorite candy like one of my favorite candies so I talked about my favorite candies but there was one favorite candy that was not on that list and that's gummies I love gummy bears gummy worms those those gummy peach ring thingies y'all know what I'm talking about those I love gummies they taste so good um I don't normally like it depends some sour things I like like if it's like the gummy that's like with like the sh the shower shower oh geez I can't speak the sour like powder like on top like those gummy words with like a sour powder those are good but like there's also ones with like they're like friend I don't know I don't know if this is making any sense but they're like two gummy bears and one sour and one sweet and they're like a connected those are like okay but um I really do like gummies my go-to snack in a movie theater is gummies um I love I, I I love a good gummy gummies are my favorite candy of all time um just different varieties of gummies are really I know people hate the texture of gummies but I like them also uh the pineapple flavor which is the clear gummy is my favorite gummy bear flavor but my favorite gummy flavor of all time might be the peach rings so yeah that is this spooky Halloween video I doubt there's gonna be another one because I make like one video every three months and I'll see you in three months. Comment your favorite Halloween candy and your least favorite Halloween candy. I would like to know. I'll see y'all later. Bye. Why did I do the hand thing? I That is not my brand. I don't... <laughs> okay. Hey. How you doing? Well, I'm doing just fine. I lied. I'm dying inside.